I wasn't muted. <laughs> Hello, hey guys. Wow, thank you for the hat pat. How are y'all doing? Hello, hello. Oh, oh my god, I'm so tired. Ah, oh. Well, I'm comfy. I'm comfy though. I just had some good Chinese food. It was good. Oh my fucking god. That's so fucking loud. <laughs> Thank you for the hat pot. P.U. Garage. Did you eat a burrito or something? <laughs> Woke up from a nap after eating New York pizza. Oh god. That sounds really nice and comfy. I don't think I've had New York pizza before, unfortunately. Despite the fact that I've been to New York, like, once? I, I think I went to New York once. I got McDonaldo. What did you get from McDonald's? What do you usually like to get? I like getting... I like getting McChicken. McChicken from McDonald's is really good. I also like getting a Happy Meal with uh, Chicken Nuggies. Chicken Nuggie Happy Meal is good, but also uh, I sometimes get the Cheeseburger Happy Meal. I like seeing what toy I get. But um, yeah, I just had Chinese. It was crispy beef, aka not crispy beef because Chinese places can never do crispy beef right. For some reason, it's not crispy. Nungies and fries. I see and sugar donut. Oh, that sounds good. I didn't know that McDonald's had donuts. They have donuts? Maybe just where you are. I think they ha they have like pies and stuff where I am. In France, yeah. Oh, oh, I'm kind of jealous. I like donuts more than pie. It is. I'm glad. I'm glad it's comfy for you. But um. Today we'll be playing more Uke. Yeah, they don't have donuts here. That's what I thought. Cause there's like Dunkin' Donuts and there's Dunkin' Donuts and there's Duck Donuts, all those donut places. They have a lot of um, a lot of competition here in the states. Though I wonder how popular donuts are in France. I wonder what kind of donut places there are in France. Pan pa pe pe au chocolat croissant French macaron. Huh? Really? They only have. They might sell you a croissant here in the states. They might. But that's about it. <laughs> Damn. French McDonald's really knows their their desserts. Really has some nice desserts. Chocolate bread. We got bakeries. Oh, okay. Okay, that makes sense. A bakery. I arrive and hear French McDonald's. <laughs> hey Coral, how's it going? Um, yeah, we're talking about- Graj just said that he got McDonald's, uh, today, and I was asking him what he got. We were talking about how French McDonald's has donuts. A croissant with two chocolate bars? Damn. Wait, is it like the stuffed- the croissant stuffed with chocolate? I love, like, the croissants with chocolate filling in them. They're so good. But, um... How have your guys' days been so far? My day today... It was alright. It was an alright day, but it wasn't bad. Uh, I had work that I didn't do much work at. And then I was doing some stuff online. <laughs> I'm just tired. Are y'all tired too? I mean, Cabal just, just took a nap. Stuff with two, cho two dark chocolate bars. Oh, that sounds so good. That sounds really good. But, um... I froze... If you guys remember, I got Kirby drink during stream yesterday, but I couldn't finish it, so I froze it. And I unfroze it, and I drank a little bit of it, but now it's too liquidy. 
Very tired? Oh no, you're tired? Wait, what is that emote? I feel like you're not- I feel like you're not actually tired. You look so happy to be tired. <laughs> not the shape of a croissant, less crunchy and more soft? Hmm. Croissants here are typically soft and not crunchy. Yeah, yeah. They're typically soft. Um... What was I gonna say? I forget. I'm here. I'm live. I'm talking with y'all. I exist. I'm a frange. You is calm, chill, tired, but with a positive edge. I see, I see. So kind of like nappy. Nappy. These are silly croissants! Yes, we are, but we, we Americans make silly American croissants that are soft and not crunchy. We might even put a fucking, fucking, make a croissant sandwich. I think, doesn't some fast food place, like, make a croissant, like, breakfast sandwich? Hey Inferno! Must get snacks, but looking forward to stream. Nice. Today's stream is gonna be really sloppy. I'm already like yawning. I'm already so tired. <sighs> I'm already so tired. You see me this in, in the um, in this blanket? That's me right now. Except I can't actually wear a blanket in real life because it's too fucking hot. It's too fucking hot. Who the fuck decided to make it 90 something degrees? Nap stream, hunk shoe, hunk shoe. <laughs> yeah, let's make it a nap stream now. <laughs> it's time for for me to nap in front of y'all. That is the content. Bake ham croissant with day old croissants. Oh, that sounds nice. Yeah, I had my blanket. Cause like VTube Studio, it saves your last uh, configuration. So if you had like whatever items you had on your VTuber body. But when you closed it, it like puts them back on. So I had this on for last stream and I just kept it on. It is really hot though, yeah. Like, like it's not too, too bad where I am, but um, my house's AC is doing everything it can to keep it somewhat cool, but it still cannot reach the, the temperature that we set the thermostat at. It's like, five degrees over what we set the thermostat at. <laughs> honk shoo, honk shoo. I'm actually a very silent sleeper. I like maybe breathe a little bit heavier, but I don't snore or anything, I think. I can keep napping during a stream wait it's it's it, oh i'm moving my mic it's good for you to nap during the stream for me maybe not so much because i'm the i'm the one streaming honk show yeah coral's still awake it's what is it 2 a.m for you the eggs i cooked kept me awake longer the the surge of energy that you got from eating food because keeping you awake Price of natural gas being up sucks for hot months? Wait, do people use natural gas for AC? My AC's, uh, it uses electricity. <laughs> honk shit, honk shit. I can do that. Ow. Yay. Yeah, that's great, Bebop. Farturnal, farturnal gas. Am I right, boyos? Am I right, frongos? Natural farturnal. You can honk shit too. <laughs> oh, now that is. That is a fart type beat. That is a fart type beat right there.
Your electric bill was up like 200% for July. Oh, I do not. I, actually, I, I, I already paid the electric bill for this month, but... <sighs> so it was three times? Three times the price it was in, in uh, June? That really sucks. I'm paying for my own electricity now. It was pretty expensive. I hate society. I hate natural gas. I hate paying for things. I hate, I hate, uh, Earth. Okay. <laughs> Two times if it's 200? Well, if you say it's up by 200, isn't 0% just 100%? Or, sorry, isn't... So if it's up by 200, it's up 200% from the baseline. If you say it increased by 100%, that means it doubled. At least that's from what I understand. I think that's why I hear at work. When people are talking about charts and charts and shit. Yeah. Yeah. This song is really fucking fun funky. This song is really fucky. F fucky. Super Mario 3D World. Nice. The numbers, Mason. What do they mean? I don't know. I took... I took Calc 3 in college, but I don't remember shit. You were thinking with the- with the up? Or without the up? Yeah. Double yes yeah, stink? Yeah, that really fucking sucks. I hope that the prices go back down as, uh... As the next month rolls around. As August rolls around. Mm, yes, mm. I love numbers. We've had a math talk on stream before, right? That was like last year. You gotta put on the Donkey Kong top. Tropical Freeze? I've never played that game though. I won't have any attachment to it. But let me look it up though. Donkey. Oh, Utsu P uploaded a new song. Tropical Freeze. It has jams? Alright. It's fucking four hours? Oh my god. That's so long. I'm playing it though. I didn't even know that this was a game. Oh, the, it was for the Wii U? That's why. <laughs> you you wanna you guys wanna know something funny? Oh we got ported to the switch! Oh, okay. So. You guys know how I have a 3D model in the works, right? I'm just trying to think about how me swaying side to side would look like on the 3D model. It'll look really funky because apparently my 3D model can bend to the side. I have a fucking spine. <laughs> Like, I bend over and I stretch myself. I can bend back and I can bend to the left and the right. Uh, and I can bend forward. It's cool. It's very funky. It's super califragilistic, expialidocious. Even though the sound of it is something quite atrocious. If you say it loud enough, you always sound precocious. Super califragilistic, expialidocious! <laughs> oh, okay, that's how you heard the Tropical Freeze OST. Oh, but it depends on, um, 
on the settings. Oh, okay. So the settings really affect it. They can reduce Ben and even increase it. <gasps> I can increase my bendage. Do frogs have spying? Yes, they do. Three doodle, three doodle, three D doodle, three doodle, fold side, yo side. I better have a silly little ass. Hmm. And maybe I might have a little ass or maybe a big ass. You will see. Hey, Azriel. <laughs> Thank you for the singing intro. I, I forgot that I knew that. That song. <laughs> yes. Mm, look at that dumpy. It's very good. Ass toggle. Mm -hmm. I won't confirm or deny the ass toggle. <laughs> I gotta... I have to do something. Deny is like well, I, where I will get drunk with friends and play Jackbox? Oh, do, is that like your Friday routine? That sounds fun. <laughs> Tiny all the way up to the cake. Yes. I had to p do something. You guys can imagine what I was gonna say. You guys can imagine. <laughs> but, uh... I do wanna- I do wanna play Yuke. But I'm also enjoying this vibe. I wonder what would happen if I played Yuke while playing the Donkey Kong music. Can I do that? Oh, I absolutely can. This is my stream. Just something that I kind of wanted to do since one of the people was doing our community night. I thought, you know, I'm going to get some alcohol. Oh, as long as you have fun. I hope you have fun. <laughs> I'll pass. I'll change the stream to just vibing. Just vibing stream. All right, there it is. Just folding side to side, side side to side. Thank God the week is done. I feel like a zombie. Come back to life. Back back to life. I got four Kai Kai bottles of alcohol, three ma margaritas, and a pina colada. What's Kai Kai? I've never heard of that before. Okay, so apparently, one of the effects you get from an area that you get to from sleeping in this bed. Does it actually work? I don't know. It's what the guide says, though. No. Wait, what? Wait, what the fuck? Did, did we just go into a world underneath our bed? Is there a staircase underneath our bed? Mm, I don't know what turns uh, the lights on, so let's just do... Actually, let me turn on the, the audio for this, because 
I do like the sound from this game. It's a bit loud. Kai Kai bottles are low bottles of pre-made cocktail drinks that's recommended to serve cold. Oh, that's nice. A pre-made cocktail. Cocktails are nice and tasty. I like these little cocktails. Uh, cattails? Cattails? Assortment of cocktails once I've tried was Margarita Long Island Iced Tea Pina Colada Mexican Mudslide? I've never heard of Mexican Mudslide before. What does it taste like? Hey Ski, how's it going? Is that us? This seems like a school? I like the vibe of this place. Yeah, the music's good. Very smooth. Very smooth, you hardly taste any alcohol. Very creamy. Ah, chocolate coffee alcohol drink. That sounds really tasty. I like the sound of that. I do like my chocolate liqueurs. Oh my god, my computer is shitting being in this area. Every time the cloud... Okay, we got the effect. We have all the effects, guys. What? Is that me? Every time a cloud goes by, by the screen, the frame rate just drops twofold. I can't kill her. All effects get, yes. So we've gotten all the effects. All right, they're 15. And now we just want to go and see the events. But since we haven't been in this area, Let's just explore it a bit. I think this loops vertically. Like seeing young Sabitsuki in Snow World? I actually forgot about that in Dot Flow. Hey JJ, no no need to say sorry for real. <laughs> it's not like we're timing you. But I'm glad that you're able to make it. <laughs> I'll dock your hours if you keep this up. You work for me. You cannot be late. Not even by a minute. I really like the pattern on the floor and the wall texture. Wait, what's Katakasa? I think the Katakasa uh, brings you back to the Nexus. Look! You're like a little umbrella. Umbrella with an eye. Hmm. I really like how the animation on the on the um, curtains is done. Comfy, yeah. There's a teacher who streams, and I go and visit once in a while. And one time, I said, "I'm sorry, I'm late, teacher. It won't happen again." 
And then one of the mods jokingly timed me out for one second. I was expecting that. <laughs> no! You're late. You must be timed out. That's a little slap on the wrist. This is a pretty area. We sit there for a while. Just chilling. Just looking at a younger version of ourselves in a hospital bed? Oh yeah, I just remembered that I gotta play Jet Set Radio on the stream eventually. <laughs> I gotta do that eventually. It'll be fun. It took me a long time to understand the meaning behind slap on the wrist. It meant... It meant getting put in handcuffs. Oh, I didn't know that. I thought it was just like a teacher slapping you with a ruler on the wrist. But it makes sense, because it's like the slap on the wrist is them putting the handcuffs on you. Oh! This is open now. Hmm. A little bit less comfy. Not a... Not as comfy as the previous area. I'm kind of scared. I feel like something's gonna jump at me. Ah. Uh. She does not look in the right state of mind, in, in, in a good state of mind. What's wrong with you? I have no idea. Are you okay? No, she doesn't look okay. Ugh. It was just the handcuffed ones because I've always heard in terms of court. You know, the whole teacher and staffing and slapping on the wrist thing? Yeah. Yeah, slapping on the wrist. What are these things outside? They don't even look like people anymore. There's a base in here. There's base in this this track. Dolls with heads ripped off. Oh, okay. To be slapped on the wrist is just much more minor than to be slapped on the face. Yeah, it's a show of lesser punishment. Oh, six. That was a thing. <laughs> yeah, yeah. There isn't- she isn't in the classroom anymore. Wasn't there a classroom here? Yeah. There's a flower on the desk. Usually they do that for students who pass away. Yeah, Nire was here. She's not anymore. Her name was number 20? 
Didn't the door say six, though? Has been in the Oxford English Dictionary since 1736. The door's gone now. Why are there multiple of her in this area? Was she cloned or something? Nibe. Oh, yeah, that that's true. Two zero. Although I guess it's just that one. This just loops really quickly. Summer vacation did come about. How did that? How did summer vacation become a thing? Because young boys had to go to the field to help their families with the crops. Was that it? Hmm. I can just use Katakasa now? Yeah, I was just wondering what would happen if I just went straight back. Alright, so, let me look at the list of events. We've seen already quite a few. Thank you, Adam ruins everything for once. Wait, what? Alright, let me see. Got the guide. Okay, so, apparently there's a thing where... Sometimes upon waking up, you can... Her headphones will be messed up, or she'll have sleep paralysis. And when she has sleep paralysis, she sees hallucin hallucinations in her room. Uh, we saw the poop hair, we saw a food cart, we saw a water monster at the pool. We just saw the secret laboratory, that whole uh, static flashing of images. Um, okay, so there's a place with an alleyway. How the fuck did we get there? If you guys remember where we left off last time, it was in this alleyway with this guy sipping on a straw. So apparently there's an event there. All right, let's go. Think it's here. And we just have to look for the open manhole. But uh, speaking of helping families with their crops, my mom told me this story one time about how in Vietnam when she was young, one person or one child from each family, or one person from each family had to volunteer to help out in the fields for like a few, a few months, a few months up to a year, I forget. And my mom offered to do it one time. It's just interesting how there's like uh, systems like that. 
Summer vacation is in a time called in French Les Vendanges. Vendange? It's when the crop needs to get harvested and the families need the help of their children. At least in France, it is because of that. Oh, okay. That's interesting. I mean, it makes sense. I didn't know about the, the eight, not paying for... Not paying school to keep their children in school with no way to cool the classroom down. The patty draft? Yeah. To help with the in the patties or wherever they need her help with. I do not know where this thing is. I'm so tired. Sorry if I'm yawning too much, guys. I don't want it to seem like I'm bored or anything. I'm just really tired. I was like trying to nap earlier, but I didn't really nap. I couldn't really nap. That feeling when you can't nap. Oh, here it is. When I went on my university tour with some kids for my college, I tried Vietnamese food? Oh yeah, Vietnamese food is so fucking good. I mean, I might be a little bit biased. <laughs> Growing up with it. Your yawn spread to me super hard? Oh, you got a yawn too? Yes, I will spread the world with my yawns. I will spread my yawns throughout the world. Everyone will be sleepy and everyone will yawn. So, yeah, I am sleepy, Frange. I'm trying to figure out where, how we got to this place before. I have no idea who that guy is. He shows up in various places. <laughs> they look like calzones is the best way I can put it, but they are so good. Hmm? I have to see a picture of it. Because I'm not sure if dumplings are necessarily a Vietnamese food. Wait, what? We can go in here? Oh, that's how we get here. Huh. Because a lot of times dumplings are kind of kind of come from China or derived from Chinese cuisine that they make. PNG idea you had of human fronts just perpetually lying down. <laughs> yeah, I tried uh, making some line art for that, but I haven't made too much progress, especially with art fight. Five, four, forty-three. Well, this is definitely a new area, so let's explore this. This area is so fucking moldy. I would not want to be in here. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. There's little openings there. Oh! Sexy, sexy leg. That looks like a sexy leg. This doesn't. It's a moldy school pool. Or maybe like a public pool too. But I guess it makes more sense if it's a school pool in Japan. It was so cute and slightly inky. <laughs> Just like me. Damn, that's beautiful. That background. Oh, that dripping sound kind of puts me off. It's unnerving. <laughs> Ooh, 
What? She drowned herself? Are there like clones of her? Wait, what, what? <laughs> what is going on? Huh. I think this was another event. We accidentally just walked in on, on, uh, on an event. Uh, I forget if we're stuck here. Yeah, I don't think we can get back. We have to use, uh... The Nexus effect. Killing me, what? But I'm right here! I'm right here, safe and sound. I like that noise. I want to hear it again. Well, let me do it if I'm already in the Nexus. Mm, that was nice. So we just have to go back there. She looks like she's doing a little dance going down the ladder. Oh, I hiccuped a little bit. I think there's just a fence, yeah. go around here. I'm really like intrigued by this game. And kind of thinking about what might have happened to this main character. It just seems so strange. Like, what the fuck happened to her? We've already gone here. Oh, oh, no, wrong way. No! Go back. Thank you. I think this is the wrong way. If you look in the food section of the Discord, you'll see what I mean? Sure, let me see. Discord, Discord. Oh, those? Yeah, that's like, um, that's like gyoza. Gyoza. I thought that was more like, a. Mm, I don't know where exactly they stem from, but I thought that was more like a Japanese dumpling type thing. My mom makes a uh, banbao, which is like uh, a type of 
dumpling made of dough? Uh, I think it's a Chinese dumpling. It's like a pork bun, uh, if you guys have seen those. Oh, here we are, yes. So this is where we want to be. We gotta find a white cat. But, uh, yeah, like, sometimes if you go to Vietnamese places, you'll see that they sell some some food from, like, other Asian cultures. Like, I went to a Vietnamese place and they had, like, fucking drunken noodles there and I'm like, Bitch, this ain't Vietnamese. It's good, though. I adore pork buns. They're so good. They're nice for, like, a quick meal. Wait, let me see if there are any other events in the alley. Yeah, he's drinking sewer water. There's at least two events that I definitely want to see in this game. One is like a full screen CG event. The other is kind of like a similar event to the witch event in in Yume Nikki. That's what I was thinking when I always see her. Dumplings is, is the ball of dough. Yeah, yeah. It's like it has a little twisty on top and it, it's like a it's a ball of dough. Those are good. I feel like that guy is gonna get so many diseases from drinking water from the sewer. Oh, this is the food cart. You're already here. I like how the clouds are colored different colors. Like there's red and there's blue. Yeah, so there's a... Uh, sometimes the white cat will be wandering in the alley. But right now I cannot get to it. Let's see, if we go out and come back, will it, will it change? Yeah, change position. Oh yeah, I love pork dumplings. They're easy to eat. Easy-ish to make. Yeah, I kind of miss them. My mom would make them. Okay, so... There's also an event here. Go right. Well. Up, left. So there's a girl here. An eye appears on her head. Okay, so from here, if you go right... Hey Crow! Hello, hello! How's it going? I hope you're having a good night. Right, left. Left. Up. There's this girl. And that's what we get there. I'm slightly upset that the restaurant did not give me chopsticks. Yeah, it always sucks when they don't give you chopsticks. Like, bruh. I came to an Asian place, I wanna eat with chopsticks. Okay, 
Uh oh, I'm lost. Thank you for the bits, Crow! Thank you, thank you! And so, with the cute doggy, little dog uh, animation too. Thank you for the wellness pack, I am bent over. Ooh. Stretch. And water. You're gonna 3D print a certain type of chopstick. Oh! That's cool! You know something else? Um, something that my mom used to do with my younger sister, because she took a while to, to get used to using chopsticks, is you take two chopsticks, a rubber band, and like a tissue or a napkin, and uh, you rubber band the end of the thicker part of the chopsticks, and then you put like a folded or like squished up napkin like right by where you um where you tied the two chopsticks together like on the thick end uh and then all you have to do is push the chopsticks together and you can pick up the food used to do that for your ex to help them use them yeah they're baby chopsticks I used to use those when I was younger, too. And they also sell, like, kid chopsticks as well. Which are basically the same thing, but with higher production quality. Oh my god. I don't think I can get out. Let's wake up and, uh, and save. Chopsticks are difficult? Yeah, it requires a certain type of coordination that... You have to, like, get used to. Little rubber toppers that do as well? Yeah, I'm sure they're, like, really cute ones. I'm doomed for eternity to be there? Not if I can help it. I can wake up. Wake my ass up. Okay, so, um... There are quite a few events in Sand World that require me to go to Sand World. I have no idea where the hell Sand World is. I forgot where Sand World is. Sand World. Apparently you don't get any of uh, the effects there. You get there from hell. But I forget how you get there. Okay, I'm gonna try to do the the um, cat thing again. It's an act once you have it, you're set, but it's not as easy to pick up a go. Yeah. Um, like once you once you learn it. You kind of learn it for life. It's kind of like riding a bike. <laughs> it's LSD mixed with narcolepsy simulator. Because it pretty much is that. <laughs> you know, speaking of, there is a game called LSD Dream Emulator. I want, I want to play that on stream sometime. Oh, that yellow world. How did we get there again? I forget how we got there. <laughs> I 
Yeah, yeah, I have. Um, Bebop, I think I was actually there while you were there, when he was playing it. I remember I walked into that stream, um, Gaboro's stream, and I was like, Oh, he's playing Spyro, because that's what the category said. The category said that he was playing Spyro. But he was playing Casper, and I was like, Why? What? Wait, this isn't Spyro? Why are you playing Casper? And then I kept switching between different games, and I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> that- those streams are a ride. Is that the one with a bunch of chaser chasers? The area? Um, yeah, Hell is the area with a bunch of chas chasers. That in hand motion is hard for you? Yeah, like when hand motion is already hard, uh, chopsticks require a lot of- it's more complicated than just using a spoon or a fork. I would I would do a, a shuffler stream with you, May Nikki fan games. I would absolutely do that. That sounds fun and chaotic. Cat, get down there. Have I ever tried playing hand simulator? No, I have not, and I haven't even heard of that. That so it sounds like a difficult game. <laughs> oh, my head aches a little bit from my earphones. Cat, please. I just want to talk to you. You may Nikki fan games, big ass mazes equal hell. Yeah, pretty much. Any big ass maze is hell. Kitty, kitty, come down. Oh, that's why I kind of figured. Um, from the name. Like Hand Simulator, it would be like a really difficult game with uh, difficult controls. What the fuck, man? Oh my god, cat. Good night, Crow! I hope you sleep well. Thank you for stopping by. Okay, if the cat isn't walking around, oh my god. Let me look at the video. There's a video that shows it. Oh, Markiplier did a few videos on it? <laughs> yeah, it looks like sometimes the cat is just wandering around. Okay, okay, so it this is actually supposed to be time consuming. Because this person apparently was chasing the cat around for like five minutes. If you're a big fan of cats, um Kitty Soros? Do they just post cat videos? I like cat videos. Uh-huh. Oh, you watch that channel too? Cat. Just come to the ground. Come down to the ground. Welcome back, JJ! Oh, okay. Cute cat videos with different breeds of cats? Nice. Hey, Riz! 
Hey, hey! Hope you're having a good day. I hope you're having a good day as well. How are you doing? I'm sorry! Ah! <laughs> I see someone else has use for that quote. How's the cat not on the ground? It's just... Is it a dream thing? You're at a restaurant? Well, I hope you're having a good time at the restaurant. Oh, okay, in Sandworld, we've already seen the bridge event. I'm doing pretty good. Did nothing at work today and it was fully expected for me, so that was great. Awesome. It's always nice be being given the pass to do uh, to do nothing at work and then doing nothing. You don't need to wake up? Is it just that rare that it's on the ground? Quote 69, your boy loves gargling D's nuts. Speaking of CZ, I miss him already. I wonder what he's doing now. I wonder if he's eating peanut butter crackers. There's another event in Sandworld? Okay. Yeah, I think there's like... There's the bridge, which we saw. Then there's... Underground facility. And then there's another sewers area. There's also, I think, so there was a, hell, a vending machine in hell, and we got the free drink. Remember, like, there was a whole, like, um, prize-winning thing, prize-winning animation? That might have been you from you, actually? Yeah, yeah, I made that quote. I said, yeah, boy loves gargling these nuts. He's in the cowboy realm now. Yeehaw. It's Choo Choo. Choo Choo and Lala. Those are really cute sounding names. Choo Choo. You know, that reminds me of Choo Choo, the monkey in Utena. There's a little monkey in Utena. Revolutionary girl named Choo Choo. Where's the cat? Maybe it's just wandering around now? Sure hope it is. Oh, Choo Choo is the name of Lotta Choo's pet bird. <laughs> Choo Choo's a cute name. Or maybe is it just not here? Oh yeah, yeah boy, I was talking about CZ in that quote, so technically it is a CZ quote. Because he talked about how he liked, uh, what is it? Roasted nuts? Spicy nuts? Where the fuck is the cat? Kitty, kitty, kitty! Kitty, kitty, kitty! I'm here, kitty, kitty. It's not here. Seasyception.
me trying to chase down a cat with my entire life force. There you are. Me in a go-kart trying to chase down a cat. Acquire Kibby. Take me to hell, kitty. Take me to hell. Favorite cat food is this is the Sphinx cat? Oh, the Sphinx cat is the naked cat, right? Doesn't have any fur. <laughs> How to get food by breed? I have no idea. Google's confused. Oh, this was the stairway down that we saw before. Oh, she is number 20. So we're 20. That's our name. Eroded. Uh, we... Everything's garbled. This is our bedroom? <laughs> this sure is a nightmare. We're just kind of stuck here. Is she in Japanese number four and number seven? It's number four. Uh, Shichi is seven. Although there are different ways to pronounce the numbers. Back in the real world. All right, so let's see, what's the next event? All right, this one, we have to go to Sand World. Ah! But first, how do we get to Sand World? Before I go forever? No, JJ, don't go! Nah, I hope you have a good rest of your night. <laughs> Thank you for the wellness pack. Mmm, <sighs> hydration. All right, let's see how we can get. Oh, 
Okay, we have to go to hell. Let's go there. Let's go to hell. If someone tells you go to hell and I'm like, okay, boots up you maniac, he goes to hell. Joke around the number four where this guy is in an elevator. Uh, guy from Japanese asks what for. Here I got him and says four four. All nervous and refuse to push the four. The four button? Is, is that actually clever though? I mean, it, it's a pretty... Well, I guess maybe that's just kind of because I'm a weeb. For she. For death. Yeah, number four is considered bad luck because it sounds like uh, the verb to die. She. She. Or sounds like death. There's something in here. We have to find it. Shinigami because I'm fascinated with death? Yeah, Shinigami are pretty interesting. I don't know very much about them though. They didn't leave enough room for Jesus. One, two, three, death, five. There's the frog. Same, same Asriel. I learned about, I only learned about Shinigami from Death Note as well. You need a hand? Need a hand? So we're looking for like this house thing, this round house, round like me. It's a house I would live in. The annual penis festival? Oh yeah, I heard about that. What it actually means? Isn't it like for fertility? Good harvest? I'm not sure. That's just my guess. I'm not actually quite sure what it's for. Hands up! Bite off the penis of any male that tries to fornicate. The female that has the demon inside her? Oh my god! That's hilarious. That sounds like that movie. Uh, Teeth or something. Very R18 legend? Oh boy, there are a lot of R18 legends. People love making myths about sex. Or that have sex in it. Because sex is funny. Not really funny, but sex is a very integral part of the lives of many people.
to get an iron penis to defeat the demon by breaking the demon's teeth? So they got dildos to masturbate with? Or just to penetrate themselves with? That sounds pretty fun. <laughs> Damn! Balls. Staff of steel. Oh, there it is! Balls of steel. Duke Nukem would be proud, yes. In Japanese mythology, they would get really sick skateboards made so they could vert transfer into the Shinto shrines. Hit a 61080 on the transfer out to repel demons up to six months. <laughs> Damn. I wish I lived in, in that era. I want to do sick 1080s to uh, repel the demons for, ten, for six months. Alright, now how the hell... Okay, we have to go to the spiral area, apparently. We have to find a spiral with a gate in the middle. Send me the article? Oh. I don't know about the annual fart festival? Wait, there's a fart festival? I want in. I want in on the fart festival. Tony Hawk. <laughs> Tony Hawk for nothing. Cause he did the sick 1080s. Oh god, I wish I was Tony Hawk. To do a cloud nine? I have no idea. I don't know anything about skateboarding. Shit, we were just here. Are we going back to the beginning? Oh, yeah, we just passed this. Welcome to Pac-Man Simulator. <laughs> just as frustrating as the other simulators. There's the vending machine. I don't have money. Oh well, we already got something from there before. Oh. Welcome to Simulator Simulator! Walking Simulator, Dream Simulator, we got all the simulators in here. We got Gotcha Simulator. You don't lose a life, you have to go to the very beginning of the game. Yeah, it's really frustrating. I do not want to get caught. But I know that the place that I need to go to... No, that's not where we want to- Ah! Oh, I think we're close. Is 
simulates throwing money you really need for other things away in the hopes of sweet, sweet waifus. Yes. Okay. Oh fuck, we were just here. It's not even just waifus, too. There are, like, games where you throw away your sweet, sweet money for husbandos. And also, maybe just weapons. Because I played a game where, basically, you just wanted the weapons in the game. The characters didn't really matter that much. Until later. Yummy. I've mentioned this before, but I could really do without these long winding mazes in Yumei Nikki fan games like You may Nikki did it. It was okay. It wasn't the best. Why does every single You May Nikki fan game have to have one of these? It's almost like a contract at this point. Where the characters are the weapons? Oh shit, yeah. Contract? Riff. Wait, what does ref mean? <laughs> you made Nikki fan games racing to make the most absurdly treacherous mazes. Absurdly annoying mazes. Oh, it means reference. Oh, okay. Did I just go back to the beginning? Did I literally just go back to the beginning? Yes, I did just go back to the beginning. Yeah. It's a maze arms race. Oh, Madoka Magica. Okay. You wanna make a contract? Gets kicked in the face. But seriously, I put a maze in my game, in my Yume Nikki fan game. I regret it. I regret putting a maze in there. Um, but my maze wasn't very big. It wasn't... it wasn't that big. Koopy. You need to finish, Madoka? You should. It isn't... isn't too, too long. But then again... It isn't... isn't it like 12 episodes? 11 episodes? But then again, it's still like 12 episodes. Six hours. More like four hours, I guess? Because they're around like 20-something minutes? I can still send you the Penis Festival article if you want to read it. Yeah, sure. Watch Meguka? Wait, what's Meguka? Isn't Meguka just like a weird prince? Ah, what, what the fuck? Meguka video? No, what is that? Get out of my face. He's going back and forth. <laughs> I hate my life. A giant penis costume? Oh, that's fine. Um, is this gonna be in the Discord? In the Discord server? Or in my DMs? Because DMs are preferable. <laughs> we were all over at my place watching until someone else invited themselves over and wanted us to do something else, so we just kept forgetting to go back, back to it. Oh, your brain is already like you watched it. 
Yeah, I feel that. Hey, Cabal- I mean, hey, Disney Eidolon! You're gonna DM it to me? Okay, sounds good. Come and get me, you fucking bitch. He's literally blocking the way. <sighs> okay, thank you, Bebop. I'm dying on the inside. They squeed? Oh, I got some some cool peeps squeeing over me. <gasps> no, 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 no. Oh fuck. I can't do anything to get out of here. It can't dodge it, it just hides yourself from it. It, it doesn't keep you from touching it and getting transported. It just um, makes it so they don't notice you and go after you. I guess I could have ninja'd before. Let's try that again. Squee and XD, it's the deadliest combo. <laughs> Squee and XD, like like Cabal just did. Use nut punch effect to punch chasers in the nuts. God, I wish. That was painful. Uwu and Owo? Nah, not as powerful as Squee and XD. I'm pretty sure- I'm pretty sure there's a you and me and Nikki Fian game with a gun as a weapon? I would be surprised. If there wasn't. But I'm not sure if it works that way. Like where you just aim it from far away and hit it. Awoo! Awoo! Five, six, seven, oh, nine! No awu, $200 fine. Hey, hey, I'm the streamer. You you give me money. I don't give you money. Especially not for exercising my right to awu. I have the right. I send in the mail, good. I'm glad you understand. I'm gonna change my name to 8675309 and always open with Jenny. I found your number. <laughs> that's funny. Despite awooing Tuki a lot, that's true. You do awoo in Tuki a lot. I really wish there were maps for this game. I mean, I guess there are if I just opened it in RPG Maker. Oh wait, you know what I can do? I can open this game in RPG Maker and look at the map for hell. First let me get there, though.
pizza, Mountain Dew, and alcohol? That's gonna be a weird combo. Yeah, especially the Mountain Dew and alcohol part. <laughs> $47,000. Pay up, Bebop. You owe me 47 k Okay. Let me cheat. Mountain Dew mixes with vodka decently? Oh, really? Hmm. When was your last charge, Azrael? Okay, now I need to find hell. <laughs> the map for the pool is called Poo Loop. Poo Loop. Because it's pool and loop, but they combined it. Okay, I found the map for hell. Now where are you, friend? Where am I located? Poo loop. It's about a two hour charge and I always charge it whenever I sleep. It lasts up to seven hours. Oh. Huh. So it's been lasting for quite a bit. Vodka is a neutral spirit, so it'd be citrus soda flavor with alcoholic burn, slightly bitter. Oh, okay. You know, I actually remember one of my roommates mixing Mountain Dew with alcohol a bit ago. And he liked it, so... Even with the map, it's still kind of confusing. Marshmallows and vodka? I feel like... I, feel... I remember one of my friends tried to make vodka... Like, alcoholic gummy worms at one point, freshman year of college. That did not turn out very well. For Boddington's Pub Ale? What is that? I don't think I've heard of that before.
But you'll have to wait until you return home. Oh, is it because it's only at your house? Hey, Jizz! Peeking in before getting cozy for bed. How's the game going? Thanks for stopping by. I hope you have a good sleep. Uh, game is going pretty well. We're just exploring. We're just kind of getting really lost in a maze and I am cheating and actually looking at the game files for, <laughs> to see the, the structure of the maze because we've been wandering in here for quite a bit. But we're almost there. I can feel it. There it is! Bonnington's is a beer that has kind of a strong bitter flavor. The overall flavor is refreshing. The texture is silky and nice. That sounds nice! Okay, so I have to find black sand. We have to fall down from the quicksand. This area, it didn't seem like sand world. It just seemed like piss world, like piss snow. Like, you know how snow looks like when you piss in it? Mixing marshmallows and vodka is very good. Oh, I think I know what um, person you're talking about, I think. Oh, got a burp coming up. Eh, I think um, they also post YouTube shorts. They did like a Werther's original with rum or something. You actually don't know what it looks like? I know what it looks like when uh, a dog pees in the snow. I haven't actually peed in the snow myself. That guy? Yeah. I think this is it. Oh! Yeah, apparently it's pretty good. <laughs> we're just... we're just... <laughs> Whoops, we fell. I'm looking at the wiki right now. Okay. Cracking black, sp black spice rum at home. Oh yeah, that rum is really good. I have Captain Morgan's with me at the moment. Because last time I got rum, I got Kraken as well. So I wanted to mix it up. Talking drinky poos, I see. He is, he is. Nothing wrong with the captain? Yeah. Just depends on my mood. We just have to, um, keep interacting here until it activates. <laughs> I phased away, I'm back. Yeah, we're talking some Alkies. Just talking about, um, Asriel mentioned this, this, uh, content creator who mixes random things with booze and leaves them in, like, a jar for a week until they kind of, like, until it, like, breaks down. And then he tries them. 
pot edible near future as well? Oh, will that be your first time or have you tried it before? Have you tried uh, weed before? Thank you for the hat pat! Woohoo! It's not activated. Oh! Oh. Hooking up to the machine. Just having a good sleep. Holy shit, that's beautiful. That's so pretty. Oh my fucking god. So cute! I'm expecting something disturbing. I've had weed a fair amount of times, just varying frequent? Oh, okay. Oh, it was last year? Oh, okay. Yeah, I have, uh... I use, uh, I, 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 I have edibles quite a bit. Not all the time, but... Like a good amount. I find it's better for me than alcohol. At least physically. I be hitting the yoinky splinky? Yeah, I, I do be. What? We're just like a pixel now. Whenever I get drunk or high, I just get very giggly. A lot of times I was high, I got giggly and twitchy. <laughs> I, um, since I have anxiety, I have to be careful about the environment I'm in when I'm high. Like, say, if I was playing a game like this, I would not fare well if I was high. Um, I'm also used to doing it just on my own. So one time I did it... Um, I did it, like, after I moved in, and I wasn't... I wasn't used to, like, being around some of my roommates. So, like... Oh my god. Oh my god. I wasn't used to my roommates, so since I wasn't used to them and I wasn't used to getting high around people, my anxiety went through the roof and I almost had a panic attack. So I, I literally just like hid under my covers and was like trying to calm myself to make sure and like I pretended I was asleep so they wouldn't bother me. So I was just like, hmm, maybe uh, don't get that high for now. <laughs> like ease into it, you know. Like wait until you're more comfortable around your roommates. What the fuck is happening? Oh. Only problem is that it lasts a long time. Yeah. It lasts a long time. It takes a while to kick in and then it lasts for like a good amount of time. Thank you for the head pat. But I mean like, I got high again, but less so with one of my other roommates in the house, and it was a lot better. Mostly because that roommate doesn't... He's kind of like me, and we kind of like stay in our own rooms. Headphones. Jibun no katachi o tamotte irareru. Uh, you can blank your body? I don't know what that, uh, verb is. <laughs> I 
Oh yeah, I don't actually do weed weed. Um, I haven't been doing that lately. It's been like Delta 8. Because I, I can get that in my area. Let's see. Tamoru? Tamo. Te. <laughs> ah. Tam. Tamotsu. To retain, to sustain. Yeah, to form yourself, to sustain your body. <laughs> when you're so, uh... So edgy, you gotta wear headphones, otherwise you'll have a panic attack. Well, I guess that's not really being edgy, huh? Okay, so... There's a few more events. Uh, I might do that next stream. I might do them next stream. Because there's like one, two, three, four, five more events. That might take a while. That might take a while. <laughs> Screams in Persona 3 protagonist. Yeah. D he didn't. He had his headphones around his sh shoulders, though, right? He didn't actually wear them. Uh, Persona 3 protagonist. Yeah, he had his headphones around his shoulders. Although he is wearing them in some art. Oh no, we're not 400 followers anymore. I just looked at my dashboard. We hit 400 uh, before stream started and at the beginning of stream, but now we're back to 399. But we'll be- we'll get there again, eventually. Oh, they're equipped as an item, huh? He's listening to the soundtrack, yeah. Thank you guys for coming to stream! Yeah, I think I'll end it there. It's been about two hours. And I am quite tired. Um... I want to get a good night's sleep tonight so that I can be more energetic for tomorrow's stream. We'll get there again soon, yes, I believe. Who unfollowed? I have no idea, but I don't want to stress myself out trying to figure out because it doesn't it doesn't really matter. All that matters are the people who stick around. <laughs> Bramp. The people who, who come and hang out and enjoy spending time here and who I enjoy spending time with. Which is you guys. So, I am thankful that you guys came to stream today. Thank you for coming. Thank you for the fart garage. <laughs> Someone might have gotten banned off of Twitch, maybe. It, it could be a number of reasons, but it doesn't really matter. Thank you all. Thank you for the hat pad. <laughs> But let's see who we can raid. We'll be playing this game again next week. Um, what else will I be playing? I do need to play Jet Set Radio, but I do also want to get one last Art Fight stream in before the end of the month. So I might stream Art Fight this game, and um, depending on how far we get in Love at First Sight tomorrow, possibly that game or something else. So we'll see. Let's see who is online. Hmm? Was JK, JK, I'm sorry? Wait, JK about what? I have no idea. Yeah. Oh shit, Gabaro's streaming! Bro? Bro, Gabaro? <laughs> okay, let's... Let's raid Gabaro. He's doing his, uh... 
the fourth stream with his shuffler. Who unfollowed? No, it's it's okay, Opalite. It's totally okay. If I am un... I think I've said this before, but if I am ever uncomfortable with something that y'all say, or if I if I get upset about it, I'll, I'll let you guys know. Most of the time, I, I tend to let people know. Um, of course it depends, but I like to try and communicate that way. Gaboro 18. Communication is important to me. All right, raid Gaboro. Let's go. My boyfriend called me and every time he calls, that gets me so happy. <laughs> That's so cute. I hope you guys had a good chat. We're ending stream right now. We're going to be uh, raiding a friend, Gaboro. If you have my emotes, feel free to send that raid message. If you don't, feel free to send that one when we get over to the other side. Um, he's doing his shuffling stream where he plays a... Uh, where every 10 seconds to a minute, uh, he switches games. Uh, he starts off from where he left off the last time he was playing that game. And he's playing seven games. He finished one. <laughs> Already. But it's pretty, uh, it's a ride. It's nice to just hang out in his streams too. He's pretty chill. But yeah, I'll see you guys on the other side. And I'll see you guys tomorrow for stream at 2 p.m. EST. Good night. Have a good night.